Media. Powered by EVGA. Welcome back everybody, Holiday Doc here, and this is another like Battlefield 3 beta gameplay commentary, and I'm using the DAO-12. This is the semi-automatic shotgun that is uh, unlockable through a variety of different ways. I uh, have chosen to go through the recon class uh, pretty much exclusively. Uh, currently I am level 46 or 47. And um, I just recently started switching over to the engineer class or the support class. I forget what it, what it was. Okay, but corner, I extensively cool. used the recon class Damn, and the I had just an absolute blast playing it so far. And this is one of those gameplays where I felt that it was worthy of an upload and at least a commentary. And what I find is absolutely hilarious is if you shoot somebody directly in the butthole, they fly forever until they hit something so if you're out in the open and you nail somebody chances are they're going to fly for days it's 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 absolutely hilarious so what are we talking about today or at least on this commentary of the day um, I know a lot of people are still very upset with uh, my playstyle and and how I transition to battlefield and to be perfectly honest I think it's it's pretty silly the amount of comments I'm getting that are simply saying go back to COD and I guess I just don't understand the mentality of 90% uh, of the battlefield players demanding that COD players stay in COD like um, I guess the number one formula for failure on this new game would be to have less people play it so if that makes sense why why would you guys keep telling telling everybody to leave your game like to me, it's it's just the frustrating, you know, the amount of hate mail I get is just is a little bit ridiculous. And that was a really nice clip right there. Just D yeah. So coming in here, planning, going for the objective, which you guys love to see. And for some reason, the, the thing glitched out. But um, I just I'm kind of confused by it. Like I know Call of Duty um, fanatics are eccentric and vocal about how they play and how they think their game is the best but I have never heard a Call of Duty player tell a whole community to stay away from their game like I've just never heard it. it's just never been been out there it's never happened it's, it just seems very odd to me that we would uh, you know try to support a game so heavily and get nothing but hate in return now I know this is going to spark a large debate within the community, and I know I'm sh probably going to get some more flack for it, but I think it needs to be brought up. We're here trying to make this game successful. Why would we do that? Well, we think it's very well done, and it's a great change of pace. You know, we've been playing Call of Duty forever. We want a game to compete with Call of Duty. We want a game to be able to play on a regular and to compete with and to to have a good time with. As well as, you know, the YouTube community is really trying to get behind this game. But if we're having, like, other YouTube commentators, um, n like, say the same things and the same remarks about Call of Duty and Call of Duty players in general, it's, it's just oh not going to turn out in, the, in a benefit for anybody, really, because, you know, uh, I don't know. It's, it's, it's a tough topic to talk about, I'm sure, I know. And... You know, I'm hopefully you guys here can spark a intelligent debate without flame wars because I really just I need to hear why why the battlefield community doesn't want anybody else joining them. Why is it? I don't know. It's very odd to me. But we'll leave it at that. Let's talk a little bit a little bit about the gameplay. So myself and my friend Blackout we're here full on rushing and this is by far my favorite shotgun I am using the slug loadout so I have uh, the advantage of long range shots and it seems to be working very well like this gun is very very good it um, 
even at range I seem to be hitting not too many hit markers either and that's a big thing especially when it, you do have that delay are, in shot oh God, so when I pump a couple time. shots into somebody okay, I need to be able to count on that's gonna that's gonna hit and I felt like this gun uh, with the slug loadout is the perfect combination uh, using the the holographic sight gives you a little bit more uh, a little bit more accuracy uh, you can stick a bunch of different loadouts on this on this gun, but I, I chose just to stick with the extended mags and the regular sight. Uh, people are using these tactical lights. To me, it's fucking retarded. Like, why are you gonna stick a, a bright ass flashlight so I can see you from cross map? Oh, there's somebody. Let's not go that way. A little swoop around behind him. Just doesn't make sense. Same with these giant or the, these team tack insertions. To me, tack insertions are the bane. Of existence. If you can have a whole team uh, place tack insertions behind the opposition spawn, that's that's frustrating to me. That that'll be huge, huge issues. And I forgot that you cannot throw grenades through windows, which is silly, and I die. But coming to an end of the commentary today. Just kind of venting, you know, giving you guys my opinions on things. I still love Battlefield. Uh, the community is kind of yeah, getting me a little bit down, to say the least. You know, I'm trying to uh, trying to show a lot of love to a game and to a community and get nothing but hate in return. You know, I, I'm sure um, if we were to do the same thing, like, opposite-wise, it would be... Hey, look at that, my teammate let me down. Blackout, jackass, letting that guy kill me. But yeah, I'm sure you guys would feel the same way if uh, you tried to fully support a game and got told to, to go back to your own game all the time. So, it is what it is. Leave a comment down below. You know, you can let me know what, what your opinion is on the fact. Uh, I hope to see a lot of debate. I hope to see a lot of change and reform in how the community kind of treats other community members as you know it's just kind of silly and detrimental to the game's health if you guys want this game to succeed you have to you have to allow the new community members in the game so once again I'm Mr. Holiday Doc thanks again and I'll see you guys later